uh, I recently have been seeing a lot of these uh, mega communism fucking people. Uh, it's obviously nonsense. It's just trolling or, or something. I know people are calling it an op, but, and some people are just like, well, this isn't even a thing we can take seriously. Uh, I don't believe that it can ever literally gain traction or actually gain traction. And because Trump worshipers, MAGA movement, the, the MAGA movement is anti-communist. So either the MAGA communists are misunderstanding what communism is, or they're just ignoring the anti-communist aspect of uh, the MAGA movement. Um, I like to say, even Trump, Trump worshippers, the, the right in America and Canada, uh, anti-communists don't even know what communism is, but they are anti-communist. They hate everything to do with communism. They still believe and promote all the myths about communist states while espousing a kind of capitalist libertarian mixed with uh, an extreme social conservatism. Uh, I'm not saying that socialist states are good or, or communist states have been good in the past. Uh, I'm an anti-statist. I don't really, I don't see them as a good thing. So, uh, and, and they have done many things that are shitty. Like, uh, I'm not going to give the USSR a pass for the shitty things it did and the murder of anarchists who didn't see eye to eye with the vanguard party. Uh, I'm not going to forgive uh, communist China for killing people who ha are drug users or for imprisoning drug users uh, in the same way that I'm not going to give America a pass because they espouse the word freedom a lot, but also like put people in prison for possession of drugs. Uh, if you are going to be a quote unquote good state, then there's a lot of things you have to do that aren't going to be the way that the states that have called themselves communist or socialist have acted. That said, the myths that anti-communists perpetuate about these states are often blown out of proportion, uh, are used to denigrate or, or devalue the philosophy of communism or, or the philosophy of even like anything to the left. Anyway, uh, I'm, I started this to talk about uh, the MAGA communism thing. So I guess some people online were talking about it uh, as though we have to be ready to disagree with those or to talk to those we disagree with. And that's true. We do have to be willing to uh, discuss things with those we disagree with. But it's just a, a kind of a nonsense way to look at it when we constantly are talking to people we disagree with, like all of us, everyone on the left is. Because we are, at, like, if we're the far enough left that we're a communist or an anarchist or whatever, then we're always talking to people we disagree with because we're such a small group at this point. But that's a different thing than talking to uh, outright bigots or, like, people who actively want to harm your comrades. Like, it's just nonsense. Uh, of course, uh, Jimmy Dore and, and various, the patriotic socialists have all fucking hopped on board with this stuff. Uh, apparently, it's the brainchild of Has, infrared uh, Has, uh, the fucking, <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't want to be ableist in the denigration of somebody's intelligence. So I'm not going to do that. But he misunderstands many things. Actually, even saying that I don't want to be ableist in the denigration of somebody's intelligence is, a, is ableist. So I don't want to, I'm going to, I don't want to do that at all. Uh, it's just that has is wrong. And I don't know if it's intentional or because he just can't understand things. <sighs> anyway, <laughs> if you just want to be socially conservative, just be socially conservative. And we already have a lot of socially conservative people in leftist spaces. Like there's anti-sex work, there's anti-drug, there's, uh, there's anti-libertarianism. There's, you know, there's literally people who are like, uh, no, you can't be free until we have a fully socialist state, which is antithetical to the actual thing, the project, but that's what they say. And I mean, whatever, 
Everybody can disagree, but we have plenty of socially conservative people on the left already. We don't need any more. Go be a right winger if that's what you want to be. We don't want to bring in more socially conservative people. We need people who uh, uh, acknowledge uh, systemic issues and want to work to dismantle them. That's what we need. So, so get away with fucking mega communism. I don't want any of it. I don't care. Anyway, again, <laughs> it's just, it seems like uh, it's a movement meant for uh, right wingers who just like socially uh, the aesthetic of communism. And I mean, I love the aesthetic of communism and anarchism. I think they're fucking cool. But I'm, I also agree with the philosophy. I also want to make the world a better place. <laughs> and I also uh, feel like doing things in the here and now to benefit those around me is the way to achieve that. But anyway, uh, I don't have much more to say about anything to say more to say about that.